though. <laughs> I got in the school year for uh, a few years, uh, well, more like six, and uh, let's just say it's been a trek. We've traveled through vast forests of English papers, hilly mountains of history, <laughs> Sahara math deserts, but in the end, we made it through. Today is a day we've been waiting for for a long while. Today is a day to remember, a day to celebrate, a day to laugh, a day to cry. But today is just like any other day. The sun still rises, the winds keep blowing, the ark is still standing tall. But to me, this day is different. It marks the beginning of a new chapter in our lives. As each of us heads off to college, we will enter into a new world of possibilities, with new friends, new classes, and new teachers. But I'm still going to really miss these classmates of mine. It's been such a privilege to hang out with them every day and to get to know them better. You may all be like, what? Hang out with these guys. They're like the lamest group of dudes ever. But I beg to differ. As you can know them better, you'll be cracking about their jokes in no time at all. And they sure know how to give a great monologue for the silly everyday struggles of life. Every person in this class adds in a different way. Whether it be performing random musical numbers in the middle of class, or being tripped by Miss Hanson every single day. <laughs> Every individual has shaped me in some way or form, and I thank you for that. It's been my pleasure to spend the last years of schooling with these eight friends and see how each of you have grown physically and spiritually. Each one has matured from being a little boy or a little girl into the young adults you see sitting before you today. As each of you head out to meet future goals, I hope you'll latch on to your faith and secure it deeply within your hearts so that you may overcome the struggles which are to come. I'll tell you, it may not always be the easiest way of living. In the end, it will be worth it. These next few years will define who you are and what you will become. Sometimes just the thought of the future kind of scares me. But in these times, I remember that God is in control. As you progress in life, each one of you will have some places of influence or authority. And it is up to you to, to decide. Will it hold the morals I've been taught? Or will I succumb to the ways of this earth? I hope that in these times, you will remember these years of school and where you were taught by godly teachers through a Christian worldview. Remember to seek the Lord daily and have faith in Him. Thank God that we live in the United States, a place where physical persecution is not prominent. But be wary of your integrity. Fear is being attacked from all angles. Classmates, I urge you to continue onward in your faith, to take a stand for what you believe in in the culture that ridicules the Savior you love, to continue towards the love and grace offered in Christ. Live your lives to the fullest. And remember, with great power comes great responsibility. <laughs>